Hello everyone, uh, this is going to be just a quick walkthrough uh, of what uh, the full project description is going to be in the comments. So I've been working on this for a few hours just uh, as a do-it-yourself hobbyist kind of thing. And what I've been doing is just trying to extend the capabilities of the Quad Cortex, because as we all know, like there people are requesting many features and we can't get them all in time. So what I basically did is that I put like a very simple dumb program on the on a Raspberry Pi and it's connected uh, with just a USB-C for power and it has an, uh, a MIDI USB to MIDI dongle and it's connected to the Quad Cortex and an old ground control uh, pro uh, that I had. And basically what it's doing is that it's just, you could, first of all, you could configure it as you wish like normally as you would have, but you could also send more than one MIDI command, which is something that I was looking for, uh, specifically because when I was like in re doing rehearsals and I, let's say I'm on a lead scene and I just want to turn on like an octave, which is not part of the scene. And I don't want to keep switching through stomp and turning it on and then going back to scene again. And I always used to land on preset which then when I click on something else, then I get a different preset and it used to be a mess. So I just came up with this thing and basically what it does is that, first of all, like you could set like, I set one to go to always to this preset, just in case something happens during a gig or rehearsal and I just want to go to a fail safe emergency preset with a scene that I know that I could work with. So that does that. And then, I'm able to turn on, so if you look close on the screen, you can see what's actually going on. I want to turn on a block from my stomp. So if I click on one, now it's on, oh sorry, off because it was on. So what is going on here is that it's sending a series of MIDI signals, it's switching to stomp, then enabling or disabling whatever block that you have on, and disabling it if you want to. So. This is like, as you can see here, it's switching to stomp and back to scene. So you don't have to do it manually and you could be yeah, assigned it for different things like, the, for example, my equalizer and you could, and it still remains, as you can see, on the same scene. And if you switch scenes, you could turn them on and off again. And uh, yeah, so this is part of it. And of course, this is totally configurable. You could have your regular uh, uh, configuration, just like one command, for example, if you want to go to stomp or back to scene that's also configurable so let me guys uh, let me know what you think i'm looking uh, to actually implement more features that i find that will help me actually uh, or make things easier for me uh, let me know what you think any features that you think or any improvements that could be made uh, i'm just doing this just as a hobby so i'll be extending it like whatever I see fit like during my free time. Uh, thank you and let me know what you think again.